completed another deal. Yes, a lot of reshaping and rebuilding going on under Steve uh, Bruce at Sunderland. And of course, in the last few minutes, we brought you that big breaking news that Michael Turner has signed for Sunderland on a four year deal. It's for an undisclosed fee, although we do understand that the fee isn't anywhere close to some of the astronomical figures that were being mentioned in the tabloids today. And just to clear up one other rumour that's been floating around in the last few minutes tonight in the North East, that George McCartney may have been involved in some swap deal uh, with that deal. For Michael Turner. Well, I can tell you that is categorically untrue as well. So it would appear that Sunderland have bought Michael Turner outright. I know Steve Bruce is delighted with the acquisition. He sees him as a key part of this rebuilding process that's going on at Sunderland under their new owner and, of course, Chairman Niall Quinn. And there's some very, very happy people just down the road from us at the Stadium of Light. And in terms of Newcastle, never far from the headlines, of course, David, possible developments there this evening. Well, as, uh, just moments before we brought you that story about Michael Turner, we had contact from this alleged American consortium who claimed that they have thrown three representatives into the country tonight and they expect to hold face-to-face -face talks with Derek Lambius in the, last, uh, sorry, in the next 48 hours. Now, I can tell you, just in the last couple of seconds before I've joined you on air, Derek Lambius has called us. He's gone on record. He said he is aware of this consortium, but he isn't aware of any meeting over the next few days and they haven't proved funds. That's the key factor. No proof of funds. And Newcastle will continue their negotiations with other, what they're terming as serious parties for the sale of Newcastle United. So yet another twist in the tale. Lots of uh, alleged interest from various different parties. But Newcastle playing it all with a very straight bat. Yes, they're aware of this consortium. No, they're not aware of any meeting. And most importantly of all, this consortium from America haven't proved the funds to Newcastle United. And that is a key factor. OK, thanks very much, David.